What is going on, guys? Briar Rabbit here. We are less than 24 hours away from the beta, and I got to tell you, I am absolutely thrilled about it. I have been working very diligently behind the scenes, trying to basically prepare for the PlayStation 4 Pro's 4K ability for the beta. I'm really looking forward to that. I've done a ton of work uh, kind of behind the scenes. That's why you haven't seen a whole lot of YouTube videos from me lately is because I've been working very hard on the tech aspect of things. So I'm really looking forward to that. You keen-eyed viewers might actually notice that this video, even though it's 1080p Destiny 1, I'm actually uploading it in 4K uh, just to play with some of the settings, just to see what the bandwidth requirements are. Kind of, you know, just doing a little testing. I want to talk about the beta. I'm really excited about the beta. There are a couple of very cool news tidbits that also came out in the last 24 hours or so that I found interesting. Uh, if you haven't listened to the Bungie podcast, they released a brand new episode today. One of the most interesting points or one of the interesting pieces of news that they spilled, and there wasn't much new news in there, uh, but was Luke Smith actually mentioned that, yeah, reset day will remain on Tuesday. So just like in Destiny 1, reset day has been on Tuesday. It will remain to be on Tuesdays in Destiny 2. So a lot of people were kind of hoping it would be a Friday so that all the new raids and all the new activities would open up for the weekend. That, unfortunately, is not going to be the case. I can understand why they want on Tuesday so that, you know, basically their whole crew is there. Their, their entire work team is there. If something goes wrong on a reset, they're basically coming into work to fix it. Whereas if it went live on a Friday, you know, it's the end of the week. If they're going to fix it, they might have to work overtime. They might have to work the weekend. So it makes a lot of sense to me that they want to do it on Tuesday. Uh, and it doesn't really make a whole lot of difference. I can definitely understand why people wanted it to be on Friday, though. So that's kind of cool. We got to find out when the reset date will be. We also got this image leaked. So over the last month or so, we've been talking a lot about perks on weapons. And if weapons would have random rolls or fixed rolls, well, it really does seem like now we know from a Reddit user who went to a premiere event over in the UK, uh, he got to play the beta this morning and he found out that there is a combination of old and new as far as perks go. There are going to be fixed perks. You can see those in the blue and white bubbles on kind of the right side of the perk tree. These perks will be fixed. Every time you get a scout rifle does not compute, it's always going to have those exact perks. However, there's also a new intrinsic perk. This intrinsic perk will roll at random when you decrypt an engram. So a lot of people were expecting, based on Luke Smith's comments, that a gun would just roll as a standard gun. So every time you got a does not compute scout rifle like you see here, it would always roll exactly the same. And that doesn't seem to be the case now that we've seen these intrinsic perks. Obviously, we'll know more about it tomorrow once we get the beta, uh, but it's very interesting to say the least. There's also the weapon mods. A lot of people have been talking about the weapon mods. Uh, you can see those down at the bottom of the screen. And from reports from this reveal, it seems like there's three different weapon mods. One will change the, the shader on your weapon. So you can see the kind of red striped uh, weapon mod down there seems to shade the weapon red and white. Uh, there will also be, for energy-based weapons, an energy slot for mods. So you can actually change what energy the weapon uses, either void or uh, solar or whatever. So you'll be able to actually change your damage type on energy weapons. And there does seem to be a third mod that we know very little about. And the conversation around it has been a little bit on the vague side. But it could be another perk similar to an intrinsic perk. Well, Again, we'll know more tomorrow once we actually get the beta in our hands. But to me, so far, what I'm seeing with weapons, legendary weapon drops, seems to be a nice combination of what we saw in the past and like what we're going to get in the future because there was a lot of frustration that all the perks on weapons were random. So it was very, very difficult to actually uh, get the specific role you're getting. If there's only one intrinsic perk that rolls at random, it should be a little bit easier, but it's still going to take some time to grind for it. We'll see. You know, these kinds of things are you really don't know how it's going to feel until you get it in your hand. So we're really going to have to wait and see on that one. Uh, I am very excited for the beta tomorrow. It is really so close at this point that it's, 
it's getting to the point where, you know, I just, I don't even want to be awake anymore. I want to just go to sleep and get up and play the beta tomorrow. So that's what I'm going to do, actually. I'm really looking forward to it. I'm going to work on uh, the last few tech things I need to work out. Definitely got to clear off some hard drive space for recording in 4K because these files are massive. Uh, but I'm really looking forward to it. I can't wait. I hope you guys will be playing with me tomorrow. Right off the bat, I'm going to be uploading a YouTube video. Uh, I don't want to reveal what's going to be in there because I don't want anybody to copy my idea. Uh, but there will be an early video from me uh, probably an hour or two after the beta launches uh, right here on this channel. And then I'm going straight over to Twitch and I'll be streaming for basically the rest of the night, playing with subscribers, playing with followers, uh, playing with friends, having a good old time. Uh, just enjoying the beta for the first time. I'm really looking forward to it, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Hit that like button if you liked the video. Hit subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I'll see you guys next time.